Exploring the phrase, in foreign lands. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video. We're going to delve into a fascinating phrase that's widely used in the English language, in foreign lands. This phrase is rich in meaning and can add a lot of depth to your conversations. So, whether you're learning English or just looking to expand your vocabulary, stay tuned as we explore the nuances of this phrase together. In foreign lands is a phrase that evokes a sense of adventure, discovery, and sometimes the unknown. It refers to countries or areas that are different from one's own homeland. The word foreign denotes something that is not familiar or is characteristic of a country or language other than one's own. The word lands refers to the territory or countries. When we combine these words, the phrase paints a picture of being in places that are culturally, geographically, or linguistically different from what we are accustomed to. This phrase can be used in various contexts. Let's explore some sentences. 1. Traveling in foreign lands can be an eye-opening experience, offering insights into diverse cultures and lifestyles. 2. Many authors find inspiration in foreign lands, weaving the rich tapestry of different cultures into their narratives. 3. Living in foreign lands requires adaptability and an open mind, as customs and traditions can vary greatly from one's own. By using this phrase, you can convey a sense of adventure, learning, or challenge associated with being in a place that is unfamiliar. The phrase, in foreign lands, can carry different emotional tones depending on the context. It might evoke feelings of excitement and curiosity for some, or loneliness and homesickness for others. Culturally, this phrase can be a reminder of the vastness and diversity of our world. It encourages us to think globally and recognize the myriad of human experiences and societies that exist outside our own immediate environments. We hope this video has given you a clear understanding of the phrase, in foreign lands, and how you can use it to enrich your English vocabulary. Remember, language is not just about words, it's about the worlds they open up for us. So, keep exploring, keep learning, and let the beauty of different cultures and languages inspire you. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.